Uh, good evening, everyone. Hello. Um, my name is Sanjia, and tonight we will discuss about how men resolve conflicts and why it differs from women. Um, the background on why I'm cho choosing this theme is that uh, you know how in uh, in YouTube or other social medias, uh, a lot of response be like Ugh, men or like Ugh, woman and I'm interested in how and why does that happen. So I'm looking forward to find more opinions here. So uh, uh, I really hope that you all would like to work together and participate as best as you can here. Okay, uh, before we start, uh, please let me share my screen first. Uh, here we go. Okay, is, uh, can everyone see the slide share right now? Very clear, feasible. Okay. Um, uh, so first, uh, here's the first question. Sorry. What must to have in settling a dispute? So um, how should I explain this? Yeah. Settling a dispute, um, resolving conflicts, they always need, uh, I don't know, skill, skill sets or maybe traits that make it easier for us to resolve conflicts. So if anyone has an opinion or something they would like to share about the questions, feel free to raise your hand and share your thoughts. Can you see me raising my hand, by the way? Uh, unfortunately, no. Okay, look at the participants. Look at the participants side. Okay, click it and you'll see somebody raising their hands, including me right now. I can see it now. Okay, cool. Okay, so the first opportunity will be mine. And the other, do you allow me to present my idea? Oh, okay. That would be nice. <laughs> okay. So, guys, uh, I will be a starter uh, of uh, this discussion. I suppose that what need to be had when we have like a dispute is um, a feeling uh, that is far from an anger. Okay, we need to be so calm and peaceful. Okay, uh, I see that. Um, uh, settling the moment is a very essential because uh, to discuss something good in wrong time will only inflict more physical to non-physical damage. Okay, in the hope of settling or completing the discussion, it won't happen. On the other way around, yeah, it will only bring worse scenario to happen. For example, like. When, when we say in very calm uh, voice or in Indonesia, it can, can still be felt as a harsh one. And that's, that's why I believe that, that um, the moment, moment okay, is something that, that is principally we must be had when, when we want to settle this. I think that's, that's from me. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for the opinion. That is really Something. Okay, what I grasp from Mr. Sunshine's opinion is that um, we need to be calm. We need to be calm because if we are not calm, we can create more damage than good, even though we try to respond as soon as possible. Okay, we're now seeing Mr. Alaliat. Okay, <laughs> probably anyone anyway, anyway, right there. Um, Mr. Alaliat. Uh, Please share your opinion. Please share your opinion. Hello? Hello? Hi. Your voice is Am not I... 
Am I voice available? Yes, yes, we can hear okay. your voice. Okay. Thank you very much. For the first, when we must have in setting a dispute is we have to have something like establish the beliefness between your your girlfriend, maybe your friend or something like that. So when it, it will bring anything or it, it will bring other things that uh, really support us, really support us to settling uh, to settle uh, the space and also when you build or when you establish the forgiveness it will be easier to make the dispute uh, finish finish easier so the most important thing i have it uh, i think is we have to build the beliefs. Thank you very much. Hey, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Lollyet, for uh, sharing your thoughts. Is there any other uh, person who would like to share their opinions? If not, then I'll choose you guys. Uh, choose one of you. Um, for now, let's have... Um, Ms. Sabrina, sorry, Ms. Sabrina, are you there? Okay, apparently Ms. Sabrina is temporarily not, the, um, not possible to answer. How about Mr. GNR? Mr. GNR, are you there? Would you like to share opinions with us? Yeah, yeah, I'm here, but I don't have, have any idea what, what is my uh, opinion, opinion, but maybe I just want to uh, put a little comment maybe. So I think I, uh, be, have a dispute is normal yeah, as, a, as a human being, uh, even though we are maybe try to be kind and then, but we can afford it sometimes uh, maybe if we are in a workplace or maybe in community in education 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 community something like that so have a dispute is like it normal so i think the most important that uh what we must have when setting the a dispute is about um, uh, our attitude how we can do with uh, elegant uh, setting a dispute so this is the the uh there's that's ways make us difference and then with uh learn to how be uh elegant uh to to setting a dispute i think we can be i, I think uh was our others will uh will more respect us even though we have a uh, have a uh, different thinking or maybe uh, have a cons about uh, other opinion. That's what my opinion. Thank you. Thank you so much for sharing your opinion, Mr. Uh, GNR. Uh, now let's have Miss Wahda. Uh, am I pronouncing the name correct? Yes, you're right. <laughs> OK. Stage okay yours. So, um, so in my opinion, what do we have to, what do we have to have in settling a dispute? The first thing is we have to have clear minds. I mean, if we may have conflicts with someone, both of us have to have clear minds so we can state our, state our opinion, state our, uh, state our uh, things correctly and not too dramatic and the second one I think we have to uh, have a good reason and good opinion and the last thing I think we have to have this kind of feeling uh, where we have to accept each other uh, I mean if uh, in the end our opinion is wrong we have to accept that and if uh, the uh, our own opinion is right and we have to be down to earth we don't have to be uh, 
we don't have to be uh, such as sombong. Sorry, I forgot. Okay, thank you. I think that's three points that we have to uh, keep in mind every time we have to settling a dispute. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. Uh, okay, we're all running here. Uh, no problem with the you know Indonesian words. Um, from what I can grasp from Miss Wahda's opinion is that one, we need uh, kindness. Two, we need to have a good argument on why. And three, uh, we need to accept our final condition as it is without making further harm to the, our opponents, so-called, in the dispute. Okay, and finally, Ms. Puji, would you like to share your thoughts and opinions with us? Yes, I'm here, Miss San. Who is your name, Sansia? I'm sorry, I I cannot turn off turn on my camera because because <laughs> I'm I'm the, on the set, Miss. It's okay. Uh, just you know, just um, uh, you can still share opinions and thoughts without, you know turning on your camera. Okay, apparently there is some, there is another, okay, sorry, Miss Fuji. Um, <laughs> uh, let's just continue, so. Finally, Miss Rasnia, eh, sorry, Miss Rasniati, how, how should I call you? I think uh, the previous voice is a man's voice. I'm sorry, I couldn't remember correctly. You can unmute yourself, Miss Rasniati. Okay, uh, thank you for that time. Uh, I think uh, uh, this part uh, can happen to, uh, can happen uh, in life. I think uh, this part is very normal because uh, it, this part can happen uh, each uh, people in life because uh, between each people uh, have different things, have different dis uh, condition and situation. So uh, to must uh, so to have in setting a uh, dispute, uh, we can have like uh, respect uh, to other people to each people, uh, because I think like if if uh, each people have respectful to uh, each people to other people maybe I uh, can uh, setting a uh, dispute. So uh, that's all for me. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much, Ms. Rasniati, um, for the uh, for your sharings. Um, now let's just move on to the next question. Okay, here's the next question. How do you think male and females differ in resolving conflicts? What creates the difference between masculine and feminine? What are the strengths and limitations? I think um, this question asks, what are the difference uh, between males and females in facing conflicts? Two, what triggers or what causes these differences? And finally, what are the pros and cons, the good and the bads of uh, each so-called um, power between masculine and feminine? Uh, anybody would like to share their opinions? Okay. Oh. Um, excuse me. Okay. If there's no one to eh, wait. Okay, there is someone who raised their hands, Mr. Jenar. Um, uh, stage yours. Okay, thanks for uh, uh give me a chance to answer. Yeah. 
I suppose this is a uh, hard to answer. I think it's a tough question, but as well because we are trying to speak in English well, so I just uh, speak and try to what is share my opinion. Maybe I, I just want like give example, and it is just my personal opinion, and it's okay if because mostly in this group is women, <laughs> maybe some of us only men like me and Mr. Sansen. And then maybe my uh, opinion is like, what is, uh, yeah, maybe make it sensitive, but this is a disclaimer. So don't take, what is, don't, jangan ambil hati, what is in English? Don't take it personal. Okay. I found the, the vocabulary. So uh, basically my big boss now is a woman, <laughs> but uh, previously my big boss uh, is a man. I think it's sometimes uh, I feel the different uh, how they solve a problem uh, in my in my point of view. So it's maybe it's related with this this what is this um, topic, right? Then yeah, I don't know. I prefer it is my personal. I prefer have a boss, uh, maybe a direct boss is a man. Because sometimes it's like not moody. If they are have a problem and maybe yeah, it's, it, like I, I said before, this is normal. We can, we have a dispute in argumentation, and then yeah, sometimes I I see with my own eyes that uh the because yeah, maybe it's a woman is like a moody person that it impact to the next until I mean a few days uh later it, he he uh, her mood still not so well. But maybe it's about personal, yeah. But we can we can generate all women like that. But still, I prefer a uh, uh, man to resolve a conflict. It's like uh, I have experience too when I, we have faced maybe a big event. Uh, the man is like focused in how to resolve it with the less power, less human resource. But when it is my opinion, when 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 I see the my my boss uh, is personally a woman, it's like I don't know. It, maybe she's not feel confidence, and then she try to be perfectionist. So she uh, invite every I think almost uh, all deputy there to solve this problem. Then I think it's not more. It's not efficient. Not not effective. Uh, so the difference like that maybe. A uh, woman, in my opinion, is like more perfectionist uh, if they become a leader. But a man, for me, is like how to resolve the problem more effective and efficiency with low budget, low uh, human resource, and but the, the the problem is resolved. And the and and about the strength and the limitation, it is a depend on. Uh, because my boss now is a woman. It's like if uh, it's very hard, she's very hard work. I mean, very patient in in now. Uh, I don't know uh, how they how she can what is uh, share or maybe divide the time uh, for work and for family. So a more strength because yeah, maybe. Uh, he what is not uh, directly responsible to to take care uh, their family like like uh, the man is supposed to making money but in this era I think that 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 kind of what is um, uh, idea or maybe uh, view a uh, point of view is not uh, compatible so uh, because we are we are we are celebrate about you know previously uh, Kartini Day. So it's about uh, when in Indonesia is pengaruh gender. So it's like men and women must be uh, in the same level. So uh, in my opinion, but I prefer to um, to be, to men uh, uh, become a leader. But this is my personal opinion. You can debate <laughs> my opinion. Thank you, Miss. Uh, sorry, Miss Sans. What's the name? Sansha. Sansa, Sansia. Yes, yes, Sorry if I misspell your name. Thank you. Okay. Uh, thank you so much, Mr. Janar, for the opinions and also for the 
consideration to all you know the rest of the women in the room. <laughs> I really appreciate your uh, your will to use English as best as you can. Okay, the next uh, person in line there is Miss Sophie. Sophie, are you there? Yes. Okay. Uh, say yours. Yeah, thank you so much, Mirsansha. Miss Sansha, is that correct? The yes, that's correct. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, it's very interesting topic for our discussion tonight. So thank you so much for bringing this up. Um, I don't want to st stereotyping gender uh, between how the male and female solve their problems, but I uh, would just talk about based on the experiences because I saw some differences between my girls' friends and then uh, comparing with my guys' friends solving their problems. Uh, I've seen, I've witnessed uh, the way that they solve their problems. Um, the guy tend to keep it by themselves, but uh, they would like to uh, talking about their problems with the one who they believe in. But women tend to sharing with um, more people than the men, but that doesn't mean that they want to the problem to be solved immediately. But the priority of the female is just they want to be heard by someone. They, the, the, the most important thing that they need at the moment is uh, the presence of their friends. So the problem as well as the solution of the uh, case it's not really it's not really matters <laughs> as long as there is someone or friends that there with them to them so i think that's the um, uh, pretty common differences between uh, especially my my friends i don't want to talk about everyone friends because that's totally different um, yeah, I think that's that's uh, the most common one. Thank you, Miss. Okay, thank you very much for the opinion, Miss Sophie. Uh, next one, we have Febri. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Febri. Miss Febri, uh, are you available? Hello? Yes, I am. Oh, <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I am so sorry. <laughs> okay. So, I do. All right. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, I'm going to open my camera. All right, I'm a boy, and <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Uh, I will try to answer this question based on my experience because uh, I'm a worker. So my department has uh, my my department had is uh, women, and uh, my direct superintendent is a man. So uh, I'm the winner, all right. And it, okay, I guess uh, the difference between uh, both of my boss or yeah, both of my boss uh, is. It's because uh, maybe the way they solve. Uh, sometimes my department head, which is, uh, I mean, uh, yeah, who is a woman, she puts the feeling. <laughs> she puts the feeling when she wants to decide something. But my uh, direct superintendent, uh, he can't, what do we call, he can use the logical thinking or the, the logical thought when uh, he wants to decide something, he analyzes uh, the problems and then uh, he come up with a conclusion. <laughs> that's uh, the difference. And uh, I guess that it uh, can be uh, collaborated between, men and, uh, between male and females because uh, I can see that the details I mean, I can see that, that females uh, can be more detailed than men. I mean, like for something, uh, for something, it's, it's not really important maybe, but it can it can beautify some things. 
let's say that I'm in I'm I'm in the business department, uh, business development department. So to be detailed person is very uh, important in this department because uh, when uh, when it comes to the customer means that we have to care about the customer. We have to care about the product that we want to develop or the product that we want to have, uh, the new product that we, want, that we want to have, something like that. Then uh, that's uh, the, the, the feeling and the taste that the females have. <laughs> that, the, that the males, uh, sometimes uh, I cannot find it the taste, the taste of the business or the taste of the something detail that uh, male, because males uh, is usually to focus on, uh, to focus on, to focusing on uh, the problem, but the females uh, can focus on the other things. I mean like, okay, uh, you, you, we can start from this and then the other one, this one, and then the solution may be like this and uh, how to, improve i mean how to uh what do you call it? the maybe the what should we call the, 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 the uh, in order to the, this problem can can be solved in the future and uh, we, we don't need to have this kind of problems anymore in the future so we can keep this one or this way something like that thank you Thank you very much for sharing your experience, uh, sir. Okay, the uh, next one would be Mr. Tommy. Hello. Hi. Thank you for your opportunity. And I need permission to Mr. Sansan yeah, to answer this question because he is the expert about male and female differentiation and about the heart. Yeah. Okay, uh, I don't want to make a bold differentiation about male and females yeah, because if we talking in your maybe in your working in your working area, it's uh, I think they have a support system yeah to define and to uh, make a decision. It's uh, in your working environment, they have SOP, right? Uh, standard operating procedure to make a decision. It's not depend on who are your boss, uh, what uh, is he or she is, it doesn't matter, I think. Because if you're talking about in your working environment and you must following the a rule you must following the step by step that already set up in your area especially if uh, you work at maybe a big company and your work in the uh, what we call a big company something like that something like uh, maybe mr narandu said uh, he was working for a government ministry something like that i think they have a lot of uh, support system right so that's why to this make a decision they have step by step that must be following by all members in there uh, but basically as a human yeah as a human male and female always uh, have differentiation that's why uh, maybe uh, that's why we have a uh, night and day we have moon and sign yeah <laughs> we have our sun and moon we have a uh, yeah male and female that's why as a human maybe uh, they have a uh, about the exposure i think differentiation is uh, created by the exposure for the single person sometimes you will meet a uh, female have a uh, strong enough you yeah, have the more power than male something like that and sometimes you will find uh, a man uh, but he always cry if <laughs> every he have a big problem and then sometimes you will find uh, someone or maybe he is a boy 
is a man, but he have a deep empathize in his heart like a woman, something like that. I think uh, how come it can be happen because uh, they have a different experience, right? If you basically you are a man, you created, you born as a man, or you create, you born as a girl, but uh, you have exposure in your surrounding environment uh, while you are child or while you are a teenage where uh, while you was in in the young age i think that can be create you be as a different you be as a different different human you will be uh, react as a woman <laughs> common woman I, something like that yeah and masculine and feminine is just a uh, yeah categorization right to be make a differentiation because we always uh, happy yeah human always uh, happy if they have a differentiation because yeah it's it's i think it's normal right because uh, we are always uh, show about the differentiation but uh, to resolve to resolve or to make a decision you can following uh, step by step uh, step by step theoretical yeah for example you can using SWOT analysis you can using maybe uh, refer to the first question is about the crucial conversation methodology you can googling and you will find a lot of information about the how to make a decision and how to make the to resolving conflict and the key point to resolve conflict is do you need to resolve that conflict or just yeah make this uh, ignoring yeah and and if you need to resolve the conflict you must uh, prepare yourself to talk in the crucial uh, environment because conflicts it's mean always have differentiation in the first time but believe me after you discuss after you if you have a same frequency to resolving the conflict you and your uh, enemy yeah? you and your enemy have the same purpose to resolve the conflict i think it can be happen and the the the, the result will be good but if only one only one only one maybe only one person have the purpose to resolve conflict but but the others have not. I think it's uh, impossible to resolve the conflict. As uh, that's my opinion, Miss Sansia. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Pomi, for the response. Uh, it's interesting for me because um, one of his arguments is how, uh, even though we were born as uh, you know girl or boy, man or woman, um, there's still this social construct. And that is actually one of the most interesting uh, neuroscience themes right now. So props to you for that. And um, okay, before um, Mr. Lollitz share his opinion, I would like to wonder and ask you to wonder because um, most of the people here are talking about work environment um as a school girl <laughs> even though um yeah we, uh, we might not have as much problem as uh, you know uh, ladies and gentlemen here has we do have um some conflicts ourselves and that would be interesting if you know we can talk about the students um uh, no we can talk about this theme from a student perspective but yeah that's just me wondering. Okay, um, Mr. Lawyer, uh, are you there? Yes, I am here. Okay, uh, stay yours. Okay, okay, thank you very much for the chance, people. Uh, actually, I I cannot give I cannot uh, give opinion or solutions or give like something exact things that can. Uh, differ in the stock of but uh, on this time I can
can say that it it depends on the character, the character of your viewers or or your or your nature. Because when you like this what I said last time, if you are arrogant or if you are egoist, it's really difficult to resolve the conflict. And also you have to know what's wrong with you. So you have to fix it. So it can be easier or it can, so we can resolve the conflicts uh, as soon as possible. And for the creates, the create, uh, for the creating of the difference, I think it comes, uh, it comes from the different, different thoughts, different opinions. I think that's normal. It comes naturally and we have to, it's like we have to realize and we have to respect each other, even though uh, there is someone have uh, having different opinion with you. I think that's normal. It's not true. So, uh, for the most important thing, when they like uh, giving the giving the uh, opinions, uh, we have to we have to know our our uh, our our area or our environments when we give the opinions because so if uh, your 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 enemies or your friend give another opinion you don't have to like something like uh, uh, become egoist you you try to keep your opinion that's uh, that's the wrong one I think and you have to uh, have uh, the the best decision so is like can answer the whole the whole uh, questions or something like try to resolve the conflict so for the between masculine and feminine what are the strengths and limitations uh, honestly i can't blame or i can choose between masculine or feminine most of them can be strength most of, most of them can be part of strength and part of limitations everyone can be that everyone can be that one so I think that's enough. That's my theme. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Waliat, for sharing. And finally, Ms. Fuji. Ms. Fuji, uh, would you like to share your opinions with us? Can you hear my voice, please? Uh, yes. Okay. Thank you. Let me hear and resolving conflict for difference between. Okay. Hannah's for me, the things that make it different are over the uh, conflict is because the wise, if a people can be wise, is the experience like Mr. Wisuda once said before. I think it it will be make them different each other. It will be make diff decision because everyone will have different level and wise. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. G, for sharing your uh, your opinion. Uh, let's move on to the next questions. <laughs> uh, well, well, this is a question. I'm pretty sure most of the previous people who answers already share their experience. So if you know, if some of you haven't shared yours or give uh, your opinions regarding this theme, please uh, participate and you know share your share your experiences. Okay, I would like to start with Ms. Puji again. Ms. Puji, the stage is yours. I cannot lower my hand. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> my internet is so used. Okay. Okay. So, um, so, well, we'll start with Miss Sophie. Yes. Uh, thank you, Miss, for the second opportunity. I'm just going to be quick. I think. Uh, Again, based on my personal experience, um, I feel like the 
another problem that we create because the differences, uh, the different how we solve our problem is uh, the women tend to want the direct communication. I mean, like they want to talk about the problem immediately uh, right now, but the men tend to need more time to maybe to to process the the problem itself so they want to be stay away for um a little bit and then they need <clears throat> they need us to give their time uh for uh for all alone but women tend to um take it as a oh you want to what is that ignore me oh you don't want to talk about this problem you do you think this is just do you think this is not a big deal for you so you just uh, go away like that so <laughs> there's a lot of thoughts going on in women's um i think yeah in women's brain uh, when the conflict happen i think that's the the, the different miss thank you hopefully it it it's clear enough <laughs> It's really clean, Miss Sophie. Thank you very much for your opinions. Okay, for the first time, Miss or Mr. Zoom 100, uh, would you like to share your opinion? Okay, Mr. Zoom 100. Uh, the stage yours. Yeah, thank you for the chance given. <laughs> You're loving the sunshine. Yeah, to elaborate, to differentiate our problems between masculine and feminine. Um, even uh, as long as we do not equal both of them, it doesn't matter because we cannot generalize, generalize it uh, both. And uh, the man doesn't impose the problem itself. We don't think too much to deeply think, to deeply, uh, how to say, to deeply overcome, uh, not overcome it. To make it complicated, yeah, which is uh, we easily or a man easily uh, takes it easy to overcome the problem itself. But I guess most of women attempts to uh, most of women attempt to deeply think uh, to overcome the problem itself. I don't. It's it's my <laughs> not my experience. <laughs> Based on uh, how to say several several uh, books or several things that I ever got it, yeah, it, it's uh, as long as we try to answer this question for Homi or Mr. Tommy, Mr. Shansen, they have different term to elaborate it. So it's not uh, how to say it's uneasy to equal the problems. Uh, yeah, thank you very much. Okay. Um, thank you so much, Mr. Zoom 100. Way to go. <laughs> uh, we'll be waiting for uh, Mr. Zoom 1000. <laughs> and now, um, Mr. Uh, Mr. Tommy, would you like to... Uh, there you go. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank you so much, yeah, Mr. Zoom 100, yeah. <laughs> Actually, his name is Mr. Hu. Yeah, he always have different name. Yeah. Okay. Uh, honestly, I didn't have experience about the differences between uh, men and female. Yeah, but uh, I'm just curious about if the leader is uh, if in your environment, maybe in your social communi social community, the leader is uh a woman and and maybe you have uh i think maybe you have this advantage or maybe you uh, feel difficult to make a communication with her i think the first time you need to be improved is how do you uh, find the key right because every human always have the key yeah? if you can touch 
her heart like the song ya sentulah dia di hatinya gitu ya and after that you can uh, deep inside to be communicate with with anyone ya yeah? even though he is a man or she is a woman and because uh, differences uh, it's uh, not always created problem right if you see the rainbow he, they have they always have a different color so if you can combine the differences or you can combining the advantage and uh, disadvantage for every single human i think uh, you can be make a good collaboration right sometimes maybe in the first time you uh, face the heart yeah maybe you face hard or difficult to understand what she means or what he means or what he wants or what she wants i think it, that, that's only about type right if you can uh, deep inside understanding what he want what she want uh, uh, as long as you can uh, as long as you can understand yeah as long as you can uh, you have purpose you have a first uh, first action or you as a uh, what you call yeah uh, initiate yeah you will initiate to first as a first person to be understanding i think it's 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 gonna be okay right and because my ex in my experience uh, i never meet my boss or my superior is a woman i don't know why because maybe it's a uh, if i if i see the opportunity the leader will be get by woman i will in, infiltrate <laughs> i will infiltrate first and i will be take the position as a leader maybe i don't know maybe that's why uh, i have not uh, opport experience to lead by woman thank you miss ansia thank you so much mr tommy uh, thank you for your Okay, let's move on to Febri. Eh, Miss Febri. Eh, sorry, Mr. Febri. Oh my God, Mr. Febri, the stage is yours. All right. Uh, maybe I will say different. Uh, I I can see that the, the differences uh doesn't uh, don't create the problems, but uh it it makes many point of views. Yeah, but, but it makes many point of view. So uh, the problem may be, it's all about the time. So uh, yeah, it's all about the time and how how to overcome it. Uh, so that's maybe, uh, maybe we, we have to uh, discuss more about that. Uh, and it can be trained uh, to, to be a fast decision maker, something like that. But to have, I mean, to create the problems. No, I can. I didn't say it. But if you think that uh, the differences make uh, many point of view coming from the girls and also the men, yes, I can see it. It clearly seen nowadays. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Febri, <laughs> and also thank you very much for putting your. Uh, Mr. in front of your name as well. Um, okay, finally, Miss Sabrina. Miss Sabrina Mawarvina. Uh, Hello, Miss Sanchia. Thank you for this opportunity. All right. Uh, I just want to make sure that. Uh, what do you uh, do? You mean the differences between men and women, or the differences uh, in general to create the problems? I mean, yeah. What you What you mean? Miss uh, it can be both. It's uh, it's, uh, it's up to your take of the question. Oh okay. well, okay, okay. Let me give the argument. Uh, maybe I just I strongly agree with the argument, uh, Mr. Fabri argument, argument that the differences uh, can make the or can create the problems. But I just want to add edit something that. The differences in society can make the potential to create its problem. You know, 
we are as humankind was born uh, with the differences in maybe the uh, economic background, the level of the status, social status, the level of social status, and maybe uh, in some other perspective. Like in society, we are gathered in one place, we are, uh, we are sitting down and we are um, meet the other humankind with different perspective and different, uh, what is it? What, what, what I'm trying to say? Oh, different perspective, ideology and cultures. Uh, if we are, if we are, didn't have any toler, toleran, toleration, 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 Tolerance, right? Okay, forget it. It can make uh, some dispute or maybe the problems in society. But I just I I, I want to say that uh, it best uh, on the our perspective to see the differences uh, between the others, like. Uh, if I have a difference of humor or perspective in some phenomenon, uh, I should I shouldn't I shouldn't say that the other's perspective or the the other culture it, it is bad enough or it is not good enough. So um, yeah, the differences sometimes. Ah, uh, yeah. In short, the differences sometimes it can uh, can make a problem or maybe a dispute but if we are wrong to act or we we uh, we are we don't tolerate with the other people it can make a huge problem in our society i think that's all that i can say Okay, thank you so much, uh, Miss, for your uh, opinion. Uh, finally, we have Miss Wahda. Miss Wahda, are you available? Yes, I'm here. Um, okay, so first of all, I will give my opinion about a personal conflict. Okay, not an, uh, not in a professional or working area. So actually, I 100% agree with Miss Sophie's opinion about uh, the impacts from the different way of thinking uh, by men and women in resolving a conflict. When uh, we know that women tend to need a clarity, right? So maybe in a conflict between a man and a woman, uh, women may be they will have an assumption every time a man, a man need time. So they will probably think, are you ignoring me? Are you bored with me? Or are you looking for somebody else? They may think like that. Oh, I'm sorry. And uh, meanwhile, I think the man will just eat popcorn in the corner uh, while not taking it too seriously because uh, they know that it will be unnecessary to get Mad <laughs> to get mad uh, and such. So when this kind of thing happens, I think this man should have at least given a woman at least uh, you need to tell the woman when you can talk or discuss, give them the clarity. Uh, and for the women, you need to be patient and understand uh, that uh, that we as women cannot always resolve things instantly. I think that's my opinion. Okay, thank you very much, Ms. Mahda, for the opinions. Um, before uh, Ms. Riri will take the stage, I would like to appreciate everyone for trying to uh, participate. You know, the people who try to share their thoughts, it's, it keeps adding. And I'm, and it's nice to see. <laughs> okay, um, thank you so much, um, Miss Riri. Uh, the stage is yours. Okay, um, thank you, 
Yes, Sasia. I think this is only my opinion. Uh, when we talk about the women and men, I think it's different on the employment. This is about the education that they get in their lives. It's really different. Uh, everyone is really different because when someone make decision, this is influenced by their learning, what they get in their experience in their lives and according about the perspectives so that's why but some people think that women uh more uh we so we fashion when we communicate with uh the woman and this is i think this is only the perspective like a stereotypes what the woman what the girls this is about how the way uh, people thinks not about the rails because of the education women can give the best problem and also give the best solution i mean make the best uh, decision in their when they face some problems i mean this is not about the uh, difference between women and men because i think that when uh, someone thinks that is really equal between women and men, how do they, they think? Because this is uh, the influence by education that they got, the books that they read, or website, or doing some seminars and discussion with someone that expert about something that maybe is about uh, employment that they got in their life. Thank you, Miss. Thank you so very much, uh, Mr. Riri, for the opinions. Let's now move on to question number four. So there's a case here. Um, some people say that men can tackle a conflict much faster and simpler, albeit not comprehensive, and women are the opposite, which means that, well, women would take problems in a more um, complicating way but it covers more. Do you agree or disagree? Anyone who would like to share their opinions, please raise your hand. Hello guys, are you still there? And then, um, hmm, okay, let me, let me choose one of you, I guess, since no one responding for now. Um, hmm, who should I choose? Uh, Miss Suchi? Miss Suchi, are you there? Hello. Hello. Hi, hi. Hi. <laughs> okay, so can you hear me clearly? Because it's, it's raining heavily here, so. Uh, although Is we can clear? hear your voice clearly, we can hear the rain clearly as well. Oh, really? <laughs> it's okay. Um, yeah. Uh, we can okay. hear your voice, so. At past 11 p.m. here. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, some people say that Ben can take a couple of questions. Okay. Uh, agree and disagree <laughs> because like actually when we are talking about the men and women point of view but hmm, in my opinion like uh, <laughs> in my opinion uh, actually we are stereotyping about it that like what uh, Mr. Tommy said before and Miss Sophie said before that it actually it's not about men and women but actually like uh how do we how do we grow how do we grow and then how uh where we live and then our environment and and uh, surprise surprise the lead uh, will influence uh the way we will act and our character as well so but why mostly maybe in indonesia and then it it is based on uh my experience like um 
yeah, I, uh, I had, uh, I have to admit that what that man can tackle the conflict much faster and simpler, because in my opinion as well, it, it actually it's not about man or woman, but uh, most of the time in my circle maybe, like uh, men, uh, most like a thinking person and woman it uh, more like a feeling person. Though it will be different if we're talking about Mr. Sunshine because he, he is a feeling person, I think. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, that is why. That is why. <laughs> that is why men uh, can tackle conflict much faster because they will they will think like uh, how 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 what we need to do to to solve this problem, not about what. What not about our feelings? Not about all oh, that person. What what? Uh, how that person will feel, will feels like? How? What about that person? That person? That person? Because that kind of thought that will will uh, will experience by most of women, I think. So that is why. Uh... <laughs> okay, Mr. Tommy. Okay, but 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 uh, but based on but actually, uh, well, right now I'm. Uh, currently, I'm working with the with the other seven persons, which is like it's combination with men and women, and then we are in we are in the uh, each of us in the remote area right now. So, and then when we when we uh, when we gather to uh, when we gather and then need to do some like a group uh group uh what to say. Uh, first of all, I'm, I'm really sorry because it, it's been a long time since I spoke in English. <laughs> so that is why I find it hard to find the, the, the word. Uh, when we gather together and then need to do something together. And then if there is a conflict, uh, most of the time, me as a girl, me as a woman, like uh, me as a woman, um, will... Will work more how to say uh, 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 i'm comfortable to work uh, with a man instead of a woman and then like uh, my friend said that because you are you are uh, you are such a thinking person which like your point of view and then how how you think like it's most uh, more more uh, similar to a man instead of most of a woman that, that's what she said. Okay, not not for me. So that is why, like, I I always find it hard uh, to connect to connect um to connect uh with a good communication if there is a conflict in the group. Uh, well, especially with women because it's it's really hard to solve some problems with them because like there are a lot of such details that I I think that I. We don't need to. We don't need to. We don't need to think about that. Like what what we need. What we need right now is like just to solve this problem and then to 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 clear this conflict. But like yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Like but yeah, I need to admit. But most of women like that. And also sometimes I, I do feel like that also. But again, actually that just like most like more like we are stereotyping with between men and women because it's not about the gender but it's about that person as uh, actually i think that's all for me bye bye <laughs> oh, not bye bye okay thank you okay thank you so much uh miss uchi for uh sharing your thoughts uh is there anybody else who would like to uh, give it who would like to give opinions Okay. <laughs> okay. Mm, well, it is that is quite you know complete, as what Mister Tommy said. It would be nice if we uh, have another speaker. Um. Okay. Let me call Miss Uni. Miss Uni, are you currently available? Is not, uh, is not able to talk for the moment. 
How about uh, <laughs> how about Miss Pichi? Miss Pichi, would you like to give uh, your opinion? Okay, Miss Pichi is probably not available to give uh, responses as well. Okay, there's a request from Mr. Tommy uh, that he's waiting an opinion from Mr. Sunshine. Mr. Sunshine, would you like to say a word or should we just skip? Okay, Mr. Lolit first, I suppose, because uh, <laughs> he, this is his hand. Okay, uh, Mr. Lolit, uh, the stage is yours. <laughs> Okay, thank you very much for Mr. Sancia. Sancia, right? Uh, how? Oh, yeah, Ms. Sancia. Ms. Sancia. Uh, I think I don't have to give more or give a lot of explanations about this one, but I just want to say that why, uh, why can people, uh, why can men tackle a conflict much faster and simpler, uh, albeit not comprehensive? Because when they try, because uh, men, uh, they try to tackle a conflict uh, logically, not like women. They uh, tackle a conflict uh, with uh, their feelings. Uh, I think that's enough. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you so much, Mr. Lawyer, for your opinion. Um, Mr. Sunshine, are you still in? Or should we just skip <laughs> to the next question? Hey, and let's move on to the next question. <laughs> Okay, Mr. Tommy, I'm sorry. Apparently, Mr. Tanshan is not available to give response for the previous question. So let's continue to question number five. So the question is another uh, case. When you have a conflict with your loved ones, are you a typical, uh, the type of person who utilize a direct uh, or aggressive style of conflict, handle conflict indirectly, or avoid it altogether? So basically, there's this three, uh, you know, three types of how people usually resolve conflict, and the question is basically which one is yours. So anyone, would you like? Oh, okay, apparently, Mr. Sunshine is now about to answer. Mr. Sunshine, the stage is yours. <laughs> I'm a typical person who will avoid it altogether because why makes conflict with. Uh, <laughs> anyway, okay, especially if uh, you have a lover, okay, because like what has been said by Mr. Tommy before, uh, your lover can raise such a very simple situations into a long period of conflict. Okay, and that's why, <laughs> okay, um, uh, I don't uh, particularly, uh, particularly, yes, sir. Uh, a direct of aggressive style because um, I suppose um, uh, direct means that we mostly are in situations of danger or resentment and we couldn't focus and think um, more wisely at a time. And directly means also can uh, in a very inappropriate situation, for example, like when you stuck in congestion or when you feel starving, but you feel like an uh, irritating mood of the day. And that's why I suppose uh, avoiding this kind of approaches will be a better solution. While indirectly sometimes uh, might be an alternative because um, uh, I mean like, um, uh, yeah, by uh, how deconstruct the code given. Okay, indirect means that it's a little bit hard to interpret because, um, uh, again, like what has been stereotyped far before the discussions, like men are into thinking people and women are more resonating in everything about heart. Okay. And sometimes they didn't connect each other. Okay. When we interpret or translate the actions into this thinking, types and they respond more from their heart perspective and it classes together it doesn't solve the problems and even make it worse that's the end of, the <laughs> of everything okay okay yeah yeah but I, I do agree with somebody said before i mean like 
we need to keep peaceful. I mean, like remain calm is number one. I suppose. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Sanjian, for the opinions. I would like to give a disclaimer. So when I made this slide, love, um, I um, intentionally choose the word loved ones because, well, love life isn't our only love. There's this love for friends, love for families, love for parents and siblings and stuff. So you can give your experiences and opinions on all those types of loves. Okay, for now, Mr. Tommy, would you uh, say yours? Okay, thank you, Miss Sansia. Yeah, I mean, in addition to what Mr. Sansen said, yeah, he's a love expert. I believe it, <laughs> Mr. Sansen and Mr. Hu. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, yeah, I think we when we have a conflict with someone, uh, especially if uh, she is our special person, yeah. She is a special partner for for us in our life. I think uh, that's the better to be not to run away, yeah? not not to ignorance, and but uh, please consider about the impact, right? Please please consider about the impact first before you need to resolve or before you need to create a crucial conversation yeah i always said about the crucial conversation because if you talk about someone who you love with her it's always a crucial yeah it's always crucial to make a conversation uh, the conversation itself always uh, full with emotional i think <laughs> full emotion in there and then uh, make you make you headaches maybe sometimes and uh, that's why yeah commonly a person always decide to keep away and then to uh, yeah in the common uh, resolving problem is uh, please give me a time yeah give me a time it's mean uh, you don't have purpose to resolve your conflict if you have a response, please give me a time. You can answer. Uh, you can make a question. Uh, how much time do you need? And <laughs> how much time do you need if you want to uh, resolve? If you want to make a crucial conversation? If you have to aim to risk to make uh, this condition will be better in future. And then, um, but please consider about the aggressively, yeah, because someone or people needs to be needs, needs needs a time to healing first yeah maybe he didn't to be a conflict yeah he don't have a purpose to conflict he don't have a patient to conflict but he just need a time he just need a time to healing healing yeah <laughs> to make healing by themselves and then he can be resolved the problem by it by themselves without any conflict and anything but and then the avoid the conflict it's one of the solution right uh, if you have a conflict if you face the conflict you can resolve by three three kind of types first uh, you can make a crucial conversation and the second one you can uh phone a friend <laughs> you can phone a friend and you make a collaboration with others to resolve your conflict maybe or in the last one you can avoid avoid is a, is a yeah it's a kind of solution right sometimes you need to avoid sometimes you need to ignorance ah it's just a little problem not not big big one for me and something like that but if your partner, if your maybe of your enemy, like Mr. Sansen said, if your enemy uh, feel that's not that's not a little bro, that's a big problem for me, and he already state or she already state, I wanna be, I want to resolve this problem. I want to talk with you, please. Nah, if your partner already state, you need to. Uh, prepare yourself to face uh, <laughs> crucial conversation further. <laughs> Thank you, Sansi.
Okay, wow. Two long responses. <laughs> um, is there anyone who would like to share their opinions before we move to the next question? Okay. Mm. Okay. Sorry, the hand raised just is just now visible, Mr. Jenar. Uh, please. Issues. Okay, I just wanna first. I just wanna uh, give appreciation for Mr. Optomi opinion. Yeah, I agree uh, with his opinion. Yeah, because the context is mean the the one that we love is wife, not girlfriend or what. So I I will uh, try to answer the context is wife. Sometimes, uh, yeah, it's, it's normally we, like I said before, we, we have a dispute, we have a fresh problem. Uh, of course, in what is in housewife, it's normal. Then, uh, how I utilize direct or indirect is, yeah, sometimes we just, I, I just, what is, take it easy and calm down and then uh, react that, there is no nothing or no matter that we can discuss. I, I mean, just act normally. But sometimes if uh, my wife get still angry or still, what is, what is ngambek in English? <laughs> like still feel uncomfortable, then I will talk. But reason, but uh, I, I prefer to have a conversation directly. I mean, like, this face to face, not not via telephone or via WhatsApp, because what? Because sometimes it takes time. It takes a lot of energy. If if the the problem is uh, very crucial, like Mr. Said, and and I prefer when I got when I get my home, I will try to take it later uh, directly. So. So if if we we if I try to what is uh make a solution in WhatsApp or maybe in telephone it will be different different what is it it different how we deliver the message right so if we meet uh directly uh for me it works and it's more efficient yeah like uh yeah but but sometimes it's, but sometimes I just what is I just uh let it flow not not get uh i know that i mean i don't really matter tidak terlalu mempermasalahkan i don't how to say in english i don't really matter it in my way but sometimes uh when it's very crucial man my, my wife still get angry so it, i i I'll talk, i will talk because it's different like right? when and, and i'm a typical person that if i have a problem personally if i my family have problem i prefer not what is updating status or outsider know my problem. So just keep uh, my own, just keep, and I, I always, uh, what is, I, I always teach or maybe uh, communicate with my wife. If we have problem, just we know, only on, not, uh, not need other know. So only, only I and you uh, uh, know the problem. Basically, well, like my parents or maybe my parents-in-law is, uh not what is done jangan sampai tahu tuh what is what how can I say in english <laughs> it's hard make yeah something sure like that so i just take know. it first yeah make sure for them not to know make sure for yeah. them not to know yeah for them not to know yeah so i just give it myself yeah that's my opinion thank you maybe money is all, all solution not i think no <laughs> yeah like yeah, this but... can be like a whole different forum after this, okay? <laughs> okay. And anyway, thank you so much, Mr. Gianna, yeah, yeah, for yeah, your yeah. opinions. You. And now let's move on to Miss Sabrina. Ma uh, okay, apparently when the men are finally finished, now it's the women that finally give their own opinions. So. <laughs> okay, thank you, Miss Anshia for this kind of opportunity. Uh, I want to tell my experience when I got a uh, conflict with my younger sister, yeah, because my younger sister is my loved one, 
in in this home <laughs> right i have several cases and i have so many ways to overcome or resolve my conflict um with my younger sister the first one when i have a conflict i when i have a conflict with my younger sister i use um, what we what we call that in yeah in social studies it 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 called a uh, cooperative cooperative means that when uh when the the side the other side have i mean uh the the needs of the the uh, the two people who who involve in the conflict are getting uh are what is it uh what we are trying to say hmm. oh yeah uh we we already know what we need we we uh, we discuss uh, we have a discussion and get some uh same goals so yeah it, it can uh yeah it called cooperative but sometimes i use segregation segregation means like we avoid the conflict <laughs> like when i have a conflict with my older sisters i just become a patty a patties what we what we call a fat in english hmm. yeah just uh be no uh just avoid the conflict just uh avoid the problems for uh some uh, for several hours so maybe uh between uh my younger sister and i just forgot about the little conflict that we already made yeah it's it's called segregation but sometimes i also use um asser assertive uh, oh stalemate stalemate uh, in in english yeah i mean stalemate just show that uh both uh you and your enemy just have the same uh balance potential and balance energy that they are there's no win or lose in this conflict so there's their uh energy still uh equal so yeah there's no the winner or the loser yeah i think that is that enough miss hope you can uh hope you can understand what i mean what i mean Thank you very much for your opinions. And finally, uh, Miss Suchi, uh, are you available? Yeah, I'm here. Okay, the space is yours. Okay, so actually for me, this is my personal opinion, actually, like when it comes to a loved one, whether it, whether it is a friend, family, or, or even the, our uh, significant one, like I tend to, be uh, an emotional person actually like uh, different from uh, like a work uh, when I when when I am in a work envi environment like I tend to have a, like assertive communication which is like I just need to make a point and then whether like uh, how everyone how everyone like uh, think about me or how about everyone feels about that because because that we need to get things get done like we we, we need to get the the, the work done something like that so uh not really how to say not really involve lots of uh, emotion or such a feelings like of course that we need the, we, we need to know about that as well but there is a priority about the word and whatever and, and, and so on but in the and the loved ones like <clears throat> about the family or friends uh, actually, not like Mr. Tommy said before that women, women, women only need our ears and shoulders. They don't, they don't need, uh, they don't need uh, uh, our solutions. Like for me, if I talk to someone that I seek for, uh, I'm seeking for an opinion. So like if um, th that is my personal, um, uh, that is my personal how to say preference. Like if I when 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 I decided to talk to someone about my emotion or about my feelings or about my problems, that I seek some uh, opinions from them. So if they only just like 
uh, listen to me and then, okay, that's okay, that's okay. I will tell that uh, you are lying. Well, it, it is not okay. I'm not okay. So there, well, we need some solution about this. And then if someone just only like, oh, okay, 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 I know your problem. And then like, mm -hmm, I understand or something like that. And I just feel that some, that, that, that person will, uh, this one is for a loved one. Okay. Like it just, I think that some, that, that person is not really pay attention to me, not really pay attention to what, what, what I'm talking about. And then sometimes I even feel that they are just like looking down for me. Like, uh, they don't really know, like, okay you don't really know what you feel you don't really know what you're talking about okay i will just listening I, I will just listen to you and so on and then everything is done that's how i feel so that is why uh for loved ones whether uh more um, this one is actually for to my family like i i i tend i prefer to have like dynamic uh dynamic how to say Dynamic, it's not debate, dynamic conversations. Uh, then like, just hold it, just hold it, okay. Or even like avoid it altogether because I think of avoiding something is not the solution for me. Because like you, you will say that, oh, this one is just a small problem, maybe for us, not for the other person. And then sometimes when I think that even if that even even if that is our problem, oh this one is just small, small problems, and then you didn't burn it, you still keep it, and you this one is small small small, and then it, later it will be a bigger, and then you will just throw it some tantrum, uh, how to say it? tantrum? <laughs> do I do I pronounce it well? Okay, yeah something like that. So that is why. Uh, for me, I tend to face the problem, whether it is small or big, you need to be clear, like what is it and then how we so how do we solve it. So that is why I, I prefer that dynamic conversation, not like, mm, yeah. So maybe I, I tend to, I tend to have aggressive styles when it comes to the loved ones, because I, I need someone uh, clear about my feelings. Yeah, that's all for me. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much, uh, Ms. Suchi. And that would be our final. Uh, eh, it's okay. Right now, thank you very much for sharing. <laughs> um, on to our final question due to the time constraint. <laughs> here, uh, here is a question Would it be would it be better if we only work with the same sex only? With the context that there are different types of personality instead, just one sex, not to mention both. As mentioned by Mr. Tommy. Oh yeah, and because the time is already constrained, I think um, only one person can answer for now. Is there anyone who would like to give their opinions? <laughs> Dear Mr. Zuma 100, there's a request from Mr. Tommy for you to answer this question. Thank you, Mr. Tommy, who always calls my name. Would it be better if we only work with the same sex only? I disagree with. Uh, this statement that we have to work in the same sex only because men needs men and women need a booster mentally it doesn't it doesn't enough we really only sure. work physically okay <laughs> not only COVID-19 needs a booster but also men and women need a booster to boost uh <laughs> <their> <laughs> Their spirit to be much more how to say uh, how to say spirit uh, to what they are doing when well, they are focusing uh, focusing uh, focusing on to more encourage okay. I acknowledge <laughs> I acknowledge uh, for instance in one of company or one of uh, school one of institution they only uh, one gender it's boring right. <laughs> 
Uh, of course, I guess uh, because we cannot uh, how to say eye catching, <laughs> not eye catching, but I guess yeah, that's what I can uh, conclude. We just need booster. Not only COVID nineteen, it's booster, but also women or men with booster as well. Thank you very much for a closing statement. <laughs> okay, that is very much, uh, Miss, uh, Mr. Koo. And thank you very much for Mr. Tommy for um, requesting Mr. Koo to answer because that is brilliant. <laughs> okay, since um, it's almost uh, 10 p.m., is there any, uh, I would like to ask two people to give a conclusion of our uh, from for the sessions uh, discussion, is there anyone who would like to, uh, you know, to to conclude? <laughs> wait, wait, did I get it wrong, or is that a closing statement already from Mr. Zoom, uh, Mr. Who? <laughs> Okay, since no one responding, I guess that is a closing statement already. But seriously though, is there a, is there anyone who would like to give another uh, closing statement or another co conclusion? And I agree with Mr. Ku. Okay, that's my closing statement. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, very well. If that, uh, since the closing statements are made already, that ends our uh, session for the night. Uh, I would like to say thank you so much for participating as best as you can. Um, also, entertaining us as best as you can as well. <laughs> um, I really hope that this will be a good end for your, uh, for your day and hope you gain something <laughs> from this, um, even if it's just a booster. Okay, thank you very much uh, for all of you once again. Uh, uh, good night, and Mr. Host, uh, the stage is yours. Okay, thank you so much for Miss Sun Shia. Okay. okay, don't forget to pronounce it like Sun in the very first to make it easier for you, okay? Uh, so yeah, as usual, we would like to give you several um, additions to increase uh, the glossary or the bank of our vocabularies. Okay, wait for one, I'm going to uh, copy that right here. Okay, wait a moment. Okay. Please wait for a while. Okay. Uh, I would like to say uh, thank you for the for the thank yous and uh, to spill a tea. The topic is actually suggested by Mister Sanjay himself, which is why which is why the theme is already questionable already, but. Uh, it's nice to know that you're, you enjoyed uh, the session. Okay, so here it is. Um, I'm going just to share the screen. Okay, I hope it's feasible, guys. Oke, okay, jadi ada arrogant, kita bisa menggunakan sombong, imperious, high and mighty. Oke, okay, jangan diambil hati, itu bisa menggunakan dan take it personal, is what has been uh, responded by Mr. GNR before. Kemudian ada perbedaan antara differentiation sama difference. Kalau differentiation berarti proses, ya. Atau upaya untuk melakukan pembedaan. Itu disebut dengan differentiation. Tapi kalau yang dimaksud adalah perbedaan, we say a difference. Okay. Kemudian tadi ada yang bilang deep empathy seharusnya deep empathy. Karena empathy ini adalah verb. Ya, deep empathy, dia harus membentuk non-phrase. Ya, the combinations between the adjective and noun. 
You can following, it has to be like follow. You can follow. Kemudian ada uneasy sama not easy itu beda. Ya. Kalau not uh, uneasy itu berarti kayak causing physical or mental discomfort. Kamu ngerasa nggak nyaman secara mental atau secara fisik, itu kamu sebut uneasy. Tetapi kalau tidak susah, ah susah maksudnya, atau tidak mudah, not easy. Jadi beda banget antara un sama not di sini. Kemudian ada yang bingung tadi antara tolerance ya toleransi kata benda bisa pakai tolerance bisa pakai toleration ya kalau kata kerjanya pakai tolerate kemudian ada jangan sampai tahu never let them know ngambek sulki ya tidak mempermasalahkan not concern not question it's not a matter for them gitu oke okay, guys semoga vocabularisnya bermanfaat and thank you so much for attending the sessions up to this night and as usual if you would like to yeah uh, have a photo session taking okay photo taking session okay so everyone please open your camera before closing okay we're going to still wait Okay, what a fascinating topic, Miss Sansia. Okay, a comment by uh, Mr. <laughs> Miss Sabrina. <laughs> okay, that's indeed a pretty interesting one, I suppose. <laughs> okay, well, okay, Sophie. Oh, uh, yeah. I suppose the next is like a be a debatable session, but oh. you know, we are few, only few men, and there's so many women here. Oh, and, it's like a judgment. Thanks that we are a minority, not get what is that's a brilliant idea okay we're going to cook it later okay miss afirwa visi suci wahda sabrina red fabri him <laughs> uni uh aris the spy okay uh, can you please turn on the camera okay i'm still going to wait for you for a while Okay, sorry, good problem with camera. Okay, as long as it's not a problem with your life, I suppose. <laughs> <It's>... <laughs> okay, yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, okay. Bright faces at night. And <laughs> Okay, guys, I suppose this is enough. Uh, I'm going to take the picture. Okay, so on the count of uh, three, two, one. Okay. Okay, once again, I'm going to save this moment. Mm, wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry, I'm not that really automatic here. <laughs> okay, the next one. On the count of three, one, two, three. Okay, again. Okay, probably I counted too fast. Some of you are not ready. I'm going to slow it down. Okay, on the count of one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. Okay, guys, thank you so much. <laughs> and I'm going to see you again in our interesting discussion by next week, okay, with interesting moderators. So please uh, wait for a while. Okay, as usual, to close uh, tonight's meeting, uh, tonight's discussion, as usual, we're going to voice out our code of, um, uh, how to say, it's like echoing, <laughs> I don't know, yell, yeah, yell. Yeah. Okay, so when I say, uh other community yesterday we say tomorrow okay so yeah other community yes hey guys thank you thank you so much thank you everyone